Thank you for watching my video. Please subscribe. I'm going to show you today how is it that I tape my feet and I use super glue. Uh, that's why I have this mess here. <laughs> I'm gonna share with you how I tape my toes and in general I'm gonna give you some super glue, glue tips. First I'm gonna tell you what problems I have. I'm not gonna show you my feet because I, yeah, I'm not gonna do that. This is my left foot and this is gonna be my right foot. On my big toe, right there, between the middle and the ring toe, I guess you kinda call them, yeah, this is pretty accurate how, how they look when they're fresh. So, and on my right foot, I get cuts in this toe, right in the middle. I don't know why. I think it's if maybe my foot is dry or whatever with the Fumikami. I get that. Two days ago, I got a new one, which is like here. But I think, again, maybe my, my the weather here is different. Maybe my feet are dry. I use sports tape. There's many different types of sports tape. Um, I like one that's not as porous as this one. This one, like... It, it feels a lot like paper, even though it's cloth. And whenever I put the liquid super glue, it goes through it. So when I put it down, I, I have the tape stuck to my finger and my tape does not stick to skin. Tape, sti tape sticks to tape. The tape will stick to you at the beginning, but once you start sweating, once you start moving, the tape is gonna go everywhere except where you want it to be. Now, my thing is that my taping has to be really quick because I like to take my time to stretch out before I practice. Sometimes I'm late, I'm not gonna lie. So some people like wrap up the whole foot in order to cover this, this part. First, mine doesn't look as neat. And second, like I, I just find it to be a waste of time. So that's why I use the super glue because this will make the tape stick to my skin and last there the whole practice. So the first thing I'm gonna show you how I cover the thumb, that's the easiest one. I cut out all my pieces in advance, but I'm gonna do it one by one here. This one is the easiest because I can just wrap it around. And again, tape sticks to tape. So here it'll, it'll, it'll stick to itself. I just make sure that the end, it's on the top. Sometimes, depending on what I'm doing, the, the tape will start coming out this way. Uh, but it's very rare, so I, I normally don't use super glue on that one. Now the next one I do, I'm just gonna do it like an abbreviated version. I will cover the, the toe this way and then wrap it up. Whenever I put the last piece of tape at the end, it sticks to the tape that I have on the toe. So normally I will put super glue on this area right here. I will stick it to the skin right there pull the skin up, I let it I let it kind of dry a little bit, pull the skin up, and then wrap around the toe. Again, imagine that this went all the way down, and this tape is actually connecting with the tape that I put here, right? Maybe I should have done it, but you get, I hope you get it. If not, you can just send me a message. And again, I put super glue on this area right here, and I allow it, I make a cross on it this way and wrap around again on the tape over here. So all this tape is secure. Mainly the reason why I do this is because if there's a cut here, whenever this toe extends, the cut is gonna get bigger. If I do this, all the skin here is get pulled with it so the cut doesn't open up further. Yes, if I have a cut, I will still have the cut. The cut is not gonna seal just because I put the tape on it, but it will prevent it from getting bigger. The next one, I do the same process and then this is pretty much what my left foot will look like with tape. Right foot, this being a cut right here on this toe, I can easily cover it with wrapping the toe. No big deal, no glue needed. And this is gonna be the same process as this one. Imagine that this is the skin and you, when you have a cut, it opens this way. If I put the super glue on the bottom here, and this being the bottom of my foot, down, I pull the skin up, and I close it up with the tape. 
Now you have to remember how you did this and why, how, how it was done, which side has a super glue. Why? Because if you rip it up this way and this side has a super glue, it's going to open up the cut. What you got to do is you got to go from below where the super glue is because this part has no super glue or even maybe even little super glue. This part will come out easier. I will not pull my skin out. And if I have any problems, obviously I go from the other side and just, just pull it out. The idea is not to open up the, um, the wound anymore. I used to put super glue inside of the cut. I know. It will keep it in place. It will not allow it to keep opening up. It will not allow it to break anymore. But this is what happens. It will not allow it to heal because the super glue will stay there for a few days. If you are in US, this is the brand that I use and I specifically get the gel version of it. The gel is just so much more comfortable because it's easier to put in the area you want and then it will not spill. And now the Crazy Glue brand, the one that has a K in the, in the logo or whatever, that is terrible. Why? It, I, I think it burns. And uh, number one thing. And number two is just like it gets really, really hard. Super glue, it's not flexible at all, but that one, no. Nah. Yeah, I'm not saying that this is what you should do. It's just that people ask me about it, people comment about it, people tell me about it. So when they see me do it, they look at me like I'm crazy. So hopefully this explains how I use a super glue. I don't know if my foot is gonna fall off because of super glue. I don't know, like, but so far it's the thing that has been able to keep me going and just without having to stop. I think that the reason why I get so many cuts in here, it's a personal flaw on on how my kama is, how I push with my foot. I know that's what it has to be, but I just haven't been able to catch myself doing it. And I obviously haven't been able to correct that problem. If you have any if you have any suggestions about it, any any ideas, let me know. I find this to be very effective for me. Again, this is not something that you have to do. Just Kind of sharing off my experience so if you have any different ways of doing it if i have any better way of doing it any quicker way of doing it please share it i know somebody will benefit from it uh, let me know if you want me to talk about it here or if you have any more questions just shoot me a message let me know in the comments below and thank you for watching and i now i'm gonna go take off this old stuff so <laughs>